Hey guys, so a lot of you have been asking me how do I render and all that stuff. Um, the bad news is the Lightroom that I use, um, I bought it for a lengthy price and I can't resell it um, and I can't give it to people. Um, I'm pretty sure that there's some different versions of it for sale by the original person, but I don't remember who the original person I think his name is Fedora, something like that. I don't know. If you know where to buy it, um, please, um, Leave a link or whatever in the description. Don't, and if you do have it, don't just give it for free because you know that's somebody who actually worked really hard on the Lightroom. And, um, yeah, don't do that thing. But the version that I received was sort of different. It's like bought from somebody, then this other person messed with the settings, and then I bought it and I added lights and I messed with the settings and I made it my own. So, the people who did make the Lightroom, they all have their own different Lightroom. So, if you do buy the Lightroom, it's not gonna be the same, but you're gonna start from this. Um, you're gonna have the same sort of stuff, but good news is there is this white room that is floating around. Not everybody has it, but some people do have it, and I'm just gonna give you guys this one. I did not make this white room, no credits to me at all. Do not know who made it, but I do know that some people are giving this around, and some people are making videos how to download it. So I'm gonna give you guys this one, and I'm gonna show you a comparison, and also I'm gonna show you how I rent it. So, also, this white room, of course, I did it also. It also has bones, and it's in the perfect position. All you have to do is open, um, I mean, merge your OBJ right here, and boom. Oh, just kidding. Did I press open or did I merge? I'm dumb. What did I do? Oh, can't open here. Okay, there you go. Um, so I already have a tutorial on how to use bones. I'll leave a link for that in the description if you don't know how to use it. And the bad thing about this is you can't really see what's happening, but it doesn't really matter that much. So I'm gonna show you me rendering this. Also, it actually renders pretty quickly compared to my personal Lightroom. It's not pretty fast, but this one is pretty quickly, so that's pretty good. And also see, also the background is right, white. It is transparent. Other, you're probably used to the uh, background being black. I think you could change it. No, you can't. But um, it's transparent. Trust me. And if it's not transparent, then there's a problem. But it should be white, or it is white for me. And if it's not white, I really don't know what to tell you. But you could also mess with the background right here. Okay, this is what it looks like. Okay, this is my light room. I added these lights. Pretty weird. So what I do is I obviously I merge it um, right here, and then um, I go over here. I'll say a load the texture, and um, this you can use this tip for all of your light rooms. Make sure you turn off the reflection, the reflectance, unless you like it to be shiny, which it kind of looks greasy and bad. But if you like it that way, then you like it that way. And also, I'm going to delete uh, the body parts, which is 1, 2, 3, 4, I think it's 5, yeah, one more. there you go, yeah, just delete those body parts, the limbs, but you keep the head, and then what you're going to do is gonna, I'm going to select all of these, this is a rig, by the way, you also have the bias, if you have it, don't give it free, somebody worked really hard on this, for, uh, forgot who made block, um, yeah, I don't know what his username is, block's term, I don't know. Blocks, if you're this video, leave a comment down below and sell this to people. I mean, yeah. I'm not a fan of like this whole stealing people's work and claiming it as well. No, 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 don't do that. Okay. So let me see this and show you how this looks like as well. And you can see it looks pretty different. Um, the background is black and also it takes quite a while to render. But mm, it's all good. It's pretty good. Pretty patient. And by this time when it's rendering, I open the paint on it. My size that I use for logos is 600 by 600 and also you guys have been asking me how to um, download Cinema 4D. I tried to do that one day and then my computer crashed, but I could try to do it again, but I can't just reinstall Cinema 4D on my computer. Well, I think I can, but let me know if you guys want that. But I mean, it's pretty simple. I mean, there's a whole bunch of videos on how to do it, so yeah.
Okay, this is the render. Now let me show you it side by side. So these are the differences. This is a uh, white lightning. This is mine. It just has a more of a yellow tone. You could fix that in your settings or edit it. Also, what I like to experiment on is um drawing like a white light, just outlining it a little bit. But yeah, it's really not much of a difference, and it's the same shadow. So hope you guys like it. And um yeah, this is buttons up, but you could do that in your settings. So yeah, it's the same thing. So have a good day, guys, and I hope you enjoyed this lightroom. Bye.